John Walker himself, Wyatt Russell talks a little bit about his character and his future in the MCU. Let's talk about it. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Comic Book Nostalgia. I'm CB Nostalgia, and we have a little update from the new Captain America himself, Wyatt Russell. Well, I gotta say, the new Falcon in the Winter Soldier show has done a pretty good job establishing John Walker how he is in the comics. Right now, he might actually be the most hated person in the Marvel Universe, and there's no doubt he's making an impression on fans. But now the actor himself has talked a little with Green Rant about his character and his future in the MCU. Now, before we break all of this down, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and ring the bell for all the updates. Also, don't forget about this big giveaway. We're going to give away this PlayStation 5 at 25,000 subscribers. All you have to do to get in on the giveaway is be a subscriber and leave some sort of comment. Well, it's pretty clear that fans think the new Captain America is no Steve Rogers. But you gotta give the guy credit. He jumped right into the game with Sam Wilson and Bucky Barnes in the latest episode. And although the guy has an amazing record and seems to be doing his absolute best, it pretty much boils down to he's no Steve Rogers and he's being spurned more or less by Bucky and Sam. Now recently, White Russell talked to Screen Rant about his character and how his version of Captain America is being affected by the reaction of Sam and Bucky. This is what he had to say. He appreciated what they were doing when they were doing it as Avengers and he paid attention. You wanted to do good like them? So when your heroes don't give you the response you'd like, it's like, don't meet your heroes. It can kind of crush you. But he might go to a different place than some people will have gone, having suffered some of the injuries that he suffered in previous wars. Now, the second part of the quote I found pretty interesting. We do know that this version of John Walker is likely going to have PTSD issues from the showrunner himself. These reactions, as well as maybe some future drama coming up in new episodes, very well could push John Walker in a direction that's unexpected. There's also the distinct possibility that he could go on to other projects, and this developing plotline could lead directly to that. Actually, the team at Screen Rant asked him directly about his future as John Walker, and what he said there seems to indicate he's definitely open to the idea. He said, above my pay grade, I don't know. Hopefully, people like it, and it works. And then if Marvel decides they would like to use him again, that would be fantastic and great. I'd love to. I had a wonderful experience working with them. And from what I've heard, the show's really turned out great. That is a nice vote of confidence, so I'm hoping I'd love to. Of course I would. Now, you can't really blame them. This is what a lot of actors are aspiring for. And although the fans really don't like John Walker, let's not lose sight of, you're not supposed to. He's portraying the character exactly how he's supposed to be. Now, obviously, if we get any new updates on the future of John Walker in the MCU... Personally, I'm pretty sure he's going to be in the Thunderbolts. We're going to bring it to you right away. Actually, we're working on a future video called The Path to the Thunderbolts, so pay attention to the channel. It'll be coming to you soon. So, what do you guys think? Are we going to be ready for more of John Walker in the MCU? And how do you feel about Wyatt Russell's portrayal of the character so far? Sound off in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you press like, click subscribe, and if you don't ring that bell, you won't get any updates. Peace.